What's up y'all? Today we are going to be using the Archaea Spellbook to do some Borrows runs. The obvious advantage to this is having a teleport directly to Borrows. This does require 83 magic and since we are going to be using the Spellbook we are not going to be able to use Ivan's Blast or any other normal Spellbook spells so we are going to be using Undead Grass. This requires level 79 and also uh, the Kingdom Divided quest series, the entire thing, in order to unlock this. I think the max hit is 24, 25, um, but it seems to hit pretty consistent. It does cost a little bit more per cast than Ivan's Blast, but I think the trade-off for the teleport is definitely worth it. So there's only a handful of staffs that will enable you to auto-cast this spell. I'm gonna make it easy today and just use the Slayer Staff. You can get this from any of the Slayer Masters, and this will allow you to auto cast Undead Grass. A small note when you are switching for Aherms and you take off your Tomb of Fire and your Staff, when putting them back on, put your Tomb of Fire back on before your Staff so it doesn't disable your auto cast and if you do put on your staff and then your tomb of fire you'll have to come back in here and reset your auto cast personally i love the way this looks i think they killed it on the animation in most of the spells that they have in this uh, spell book especially since they've updated it I also choose to do carols with magic. I think it's just as easy as doing melee, if not a little bit easier since you'll have to bring that switch. Now for lower levels, you may want to bring extra prayer pots. Um, I'm at 84 defense, so I'm able to tank them pretty well with Borrow's gear. I think it's also good to note with the shorter runs, you're not gonna be using a ton of food. Um, so it's a lot easier and cheaper to bring your cheap food since you're not going to be using a full inventory. Um, if you're tanking, you should be able to absorb the hits. If you're not, you should be using prayer anyway. Now the formula I follow as far as kills and percentage down here is two skeletons, one blood worm, and then whatever of the Barrows brothers you have left. This will put you around like 86.5%, which is a nice sweet spot to be able to get you some Borrows equipment. Nothing good, but hoping for better luck next time. So it's as easy as uh, wash, rinse, repeat. Come back to Ferox Enclave or wherever you choose to go. This is just nice guys refreshment pool. Slap a comment below and let us know how that worked out for y'all. And don't forget to subscribe.